Daniil Medvedev has admitted that his focus was on the Premier League this week and not his fight for the top spot of the rankings. The Russian will be the new world number one on Monday after Novak Djokovic suffered a shock defeat to qualify a Yuri Vesely in Dubai. While Medvedev will end an 18-year run of Big Four dominance at the top of tennis, it's Liverpool forward Mo Salah who has been making him happy. Medvedev will be the new world number one come Monday when the ATP rankings update. It will be the first time since February 1, 2004 that the top spot won't be occupied by either Djokovic, Federer, Nadal or Murray, bringing an end to their 18-year dominance. The US Open champion was in contention for the number one position with both him and Djokovic playing ATP 500 tournaments this week in Acapulco and Dubai respectively. It was the Serbs' loss in the Dubai quarter-finals on Thursday that handed the 26-year-old the top ranking, with Medvedev already through to his own quarter-final in Mexico which he later won. The five-time champion in Dubai was upset by Vesely 6-4 7-6-2 in under two hours, meaning he gave up his world number one ranking to Medvedev after a total of 361 weeks at the top. When all of the focus in the tennis world this week was on the fight for the top spot, the new world number one himself was busy investing his time in fantasy Premier League. The Russian took advantage of his long breaks in the shade during his practice sessions in the sweltering Acapulco heat to check his team and watch the on-site screens showing the games. While everyone would assume Medvedev had his mind firmly on his fight to become the new world number one, the 26-year-old was crying out in celebration at one of Mosala's goals. When he wasn't practicing, he was checking his phone throughout the day until he goes to bed according to the ATP tour, all to keep a close eye on his FPL team. Yeah, I really love it. He exclaimed after being asked about fantasy football. I play with my friends, I try to follow matches, pick the best team, so I really enjoy it, you know? Before his new world number one ranking was confirmed, FPL served as the perfect distraction for Medvedev in all of the hype and the 13-time title winner chose to celebrate Salah's success instead of worry about the ranking battle after admitting he was one of many who triple-captained the Liverpool star this week. Speaking about his love for FPL, tennis new world number one said, Sometimes I get angry when someone doesn't score a penalty or something like that. But it's fun. Really fun. Also, it makes me follow a sport I love, which is also great. In a week with already plenty to celebrate, Medvedev admitted it was his team's captain who made him super, super happy. Having beaten Pablo Adujar on Wednesday to make the quarter-finals, the stage which later proved crucial and saw him overtake Djokovic, Medvedev was busy watching the football when he wasn't on the match court. For example, today there were three matches, I watched them all, and triple captained my captain Salah, so I was super, super happy, he smiled. Salah's haul of 84 points for those who triple captained him for Liverpool's 7-0 thrashing of Leeds are still nothing compared to the 8,615 ATP ranking points Medvedev now holds after making the Acapulco semi-finals and he could still extend his lead as the new top-ranked player if he goes on to make the final or win the title.